There's so much water on the tent. <coughs> we just laid our <coughs> top of our tent out to dry a little bit, but look at these dogs. And then Gumbo's just awkwardly standing there and watching. Oh, oh, oh. Scooting his butt. <laughs> Cleaning up the tent. Oh, it's not raining, so that's a start. Good way to start our morning. And not having to wake up for sunrise. That's a plus. Sydney doing some dog training. Oh, he's it's like so hugging funny. awkwardly. We just packed up everything. Oh, now we're out. <laughs> Our car's like, what is happening? Are they both hugging each other? <laughs> oh, it'd be cute if Eagle also hugged. We were supposed to be here yesterday, but it was pouring. And now it's cloudy. And we got a little bit of this residual cloud down here. But you can see the mountain. The water is blue-ish. Maple is crying because she's in back. But she needs to learn to not be crazy about being in front and she's obsessed about the water. Just walking around, trying to get them a little tired out before we maybe try to canoe. We'll see how that works out. All right, just did a quick little hike up, or like a, it's like a walk more say, 0.6 miles or something to Mistaya Canyon. It's got a little waterfall. Goes into a canyon down here. It's like the shot is like that right there, but it's so sunny right now. I'm hoping a cloud, we get some cloud, cloud coverage. Um, we got some sun now after a lot of rain. Maple's hot. Good girl, Maple. Babe, gummies. Come on, hi, Bubba. It's lunchtime. So we're in a random parking lot. Boiling water on the ground to make ramen. I don't even know where we are. Bridge. Natural bridges. I know, but like, I don't even know what it looks like. Never, never. Yeah, oh, okay, cool. Mm -hmm. Thanks for that tour guide, Sydney. Mm -hmm. Look how muddy my shoes got at that Emerald Lake. Takakao waterfall, whatever. It's in Yoho. It's like the big waterfall of Yoho. And it was a really short hike from the parking lot. We just, we're walking towards it, which is getting bigger. We took some photos back there. Gumbo has shrimp. Gumbo, you got shrimp, Bubba's? You dropped him, so he's dirty. Fancy. Oh, it's a Fancy. The ego. Excuse me, that's Troy. Oh, oh Troy Bolton. Troy Bolton. Troy Bolton. PT. PT. All right, so we got to home sweet home for the next two nights. It's all free dispersed camping along Abraham Lake, and there's a bunch of people camping over there. We just drove over and found a fire ring someone had already made. So, yeah, there's a lot of space. We camped here in the winter, but it did not look anything like this. Boys roast some weenies for you. Yes. You want your boys weenies? You want your boy weenies? Boys weenies? Yeah. You want Eagle's weenies? <laughs> oh, that's weird. Got a fire going. Sydney, the fire's like not as great as it was before. We're gonna need a bigger one for these pictures. We got our tents. Look at this view. We only have one. Wait, not yet, because it's gonna still take a while to get. Why don't you flip them? Flip the logs first. Up to this view. Well, technically, I woke up to this view with Gumbo peeing like right there, but close enough. Gumbo. <clears throat> Ego's eating some grass. We're all just like watching the lake. Where's Fancy? Fancy! I think she's still eating grass. Oh, is she? Blowing the lawn. Babe, babe. Oh, she's right here. Here she comes. Hi, sweet girl. Oh, where'd you go? She's just having her blast walking around. What? Hi, Mapes. You need some grass? Yeah. Grass time. We haven't done much today. We made breakfast. Lucy's taking a nap in her tent. It's really sunny today, which is unusual considering the last couple days we've had been rainy. And Sydney's over there kayaking with 
Ego and Maple for being very good. Really tipping to one side. <laughs> I'm gonna keep tipping to that side, so I'm gonna lean this way. No. Now we just left the lake. We've just been chilling, hanging out all day, playing with the dogs in the water, taking a chill day. But we're now doing the Pedo or Pedo, whatever lake hike. And it's a lake that looks like a dog or a wolf. There it is. Oop. There it is. Right there. Looks like a little wolf. It's a pointy eared dog. I see, oh, can you see it? Doggo! Looks like Ego. None of my dogs have pointy ears like that though. So it's like a wolf. That's Pedo Lake, or Pedo, Pedo Lake is what it's called. Um, maple, Gumby's. Let's see if he was taking a photo. Lucy went down there to take a photo. How about Ego being good? Yeah, so we made it for sunset. It looks really pretty. We were trying to get here for sunrise and none of us woke up. So, lol. <laughs> Maple. Maple hurt her feet at the lake. It's too rocky, so I think I'm gonna have to carry her down because she's not wanting to like take photos or anything. <clears throat> Lucy, go. Oh, I can't even see her anymore. The water. You peeing into the water? Mm -hmm. Wow, your, water, your pee is so clear. Yeah, I'm very hydrated right now. <laughs> yeah, that's good. <laughs> I've only had water for the last five days, so you know. That's good. The dogs are cooling off a little bit before we go. We packed up all our stuff. And Lucy's weather. And these two are just, oh, it looks really pretty with like the sparkly chewing sticks and splashing around. Oh, well, Nathan caught a big stick. No one said, this is mine! <laughs> and Eva has that tiny one. What is he even doing? Oh. That's his little tiny stick. <laughs> oh. <laughs> we made it to Jasper. And we finally have service after two whole days of not having any service. And someone just DM'd me. Uh, if we were okay because they haven't seen any stories in the last 48 hours and they were like this is weird but just wondering are you guys okay and I was like yeah no they were like we I haven't seen any three of you post stories and I was like yeah we are we didn't get eaten by a bear we just didn't have service so we're at the what what how do you say this what what Petey camps ground Rafiki what Petey the maples her she's injured her feet a little bit so we're gonna put on some booties for the rest of the trip too many rock too much rock climbing for mapes and now she's eating weird stuff off the ground Whew. just took a shower at the campsite it's been about two and a half days since any of us have taken a shower because we were camping at abraham and it's dispersed camping so there's no bathrooms no showers no nothing and i haven't taken a video of my face in a while and look how tan i got holy moly so yeah, we um, just took a shower. It's hot. It's 85, 90 degrees here with like barely any shade in our campsite. So we're currently sitting in the car taking turns showering so the AC can stay on for the dogs. Um, but what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna go into the town of Jasper, which is only about 10 minutes away. And we're gonna find a Tim Hortons or a coffee shop and just sit outside in the shade with the dogs and so we can get some Wi-Fi and work on some stuff and then we're gonna go up and take the tram up to Whistler for sunset um, but it just wasn't worth staying at the campsite when there's literally no shade and it's just miserable and we might as well get some Wi-Fi or something and so the dogs are just oh my gosh Maple do you see her right now the dogs are just all gumbies hanging out over here in the AC we have it on full blast if you can hear it um, just trying to stay comfortable it's just been crazy because the first you know half of our trip last week it was raining and cloudy and so you know we easily some people have asked us like what we do with our dogs when we're shopping um we just leave the dogs in the car if it is okay to stay in the car and by that i mean like it's raining and it's not hot at all 
our dogs stay in the car with the windows rolled down um, for a couple for like up to two hours ish but in this kind of weather we would never leave the dogs in the car so like Sydney and I when we were eating earlier we stopped at a rest area and got some food we took turns going in so the car could stay on with the AC um, and just like right now we're not gonna um, have the dogs just like sitting out in a open you know campsite with because it's hot but yeah we're gonna go and try to find some wi-fi we've just been driving from you know up to jasper it's about three hours away from banff so we were about you know off the road from abraham a little bit so we set up our tent got our campsite ready for when we get back after sunset and we'll sleep and tomorrow morning we are going early morning paddling um to spirit island and i don't know it's like eight miles or something is what lucy said and i not looking forward to it because last time when we did Powell I was like dying because it was so hard so we're gonna have a canoe and then my kayak that I have above my car um yeah with my little Canada flag I've been making our dogs fold I have a little one in Sydney as a big one um, so yeah we might we'll see if we'll do any shopping in Jasper if not we're gonna just go ahead and hang out get a cool drink and just get some wi-fi and let the dogs hang and whatnot we're at Tim Hortons getting some Wi-Fi and some food. And the dogs are cooling off here in Maple, has her boots on now. She's sleeping on top of Dumbo right now. And there's Fancy. Look at me, so cute. Oh. All right, so we came back to the campsite, Maple and Gumbo here. And Sydney and Lucy went to go up to Whistler Mountain. You take a tram up there. But Maple is not feeling very good with her feet, and she didn't really want to wear her booty, so we weren't going to push it with her. Um, she's been pretty good today, except for some random barking. And she, I don't know what my dogs are and them wanting to be at, like, the ultimate end of their leash, but just giving them a little bit time to chill. Hopefully her feet will feel better by tomorrow. Um, I'm just editing some photos now. <laughs> Before I go to sleep to wake up for sunrise tomorrow, luckily I can work anywhere. I don't have Wi-Fi on my computer, but I do have a power source because my computer dies so dang fast. But there's Marine Lake. I just posted that photo on Instagram, actually. Maple, you feeling better? Mip, mips. <laughs>